from NBC News. This is Today with Kathy Lee Gifford and Hoda Kotb from Studio 1A in Rockefeller Plaza. Cupcakes, delicious. It is time for Sarah in the City when Cupcakes. our Sarah Haynes leaves the safety of our studio to explore everything New York has to offer. This time around, Sarah satisfies her sweet tooth and goes a little crazy for cupcakes. Uh -huh. As I always do. The delicious dessert comes in all shapes, swirls, and sizes. I created my own cupcake tour and did the tasting for you at four different so sweet, sweet spots <laughs> all over Manhattan. <laughs> My first stop was Magnolia Bakery on the Upper West Side. These retro cupcakes were a favorite in Sex and the City. Bobby Lloyd is the chief baking officer of this sweet spot. I recognize the Magnolia cupcake by the swirl. Is that a hard thing to do? It is very hard to do. It can take our staff anywhere from 8 to 40 hours to perfect their Magnolia swirl. Twirl your cupcake Twirl. and ever so gently lift up. It's little, it's a baby, but it's in there. See? Look at my swirl. I wanted to show off my skills to master cupcake froster, Leona. Gosh, you're an artiste. That's a swirl. Leona, cheers. That was really, well, I probably shouldn't touch your cake. <laughs> Yours are sellable. But I didn't come to Magnolia to swirl. I also wanted to taste. Who's going to give me a bite of their cupcake? He'll share a cupcake, will not give me a hug. These are the kind of boys I meet. <laughs> I followed my sweet tooth to Baby Cakes NYC on the Lower East Side, a cupcake mecca for vegans. Are they really a healthy option or am I fooling myself right um, I mean, a lot of people think that it's much healthier to be gluten-free. I mean, we eat a lot of over-processed wheat in our everyday life, so I mean, I think it's definitely healthier. Okay, this is going to be an interesting bite. Time for a <laughs> taste test challenge. A gluten-free brownie mint cupcake. Mmm. Right? Oh my gosh, it tastes like the ice cream. We also do frosting shots. If you didn't get enough frosting, you can get a shot of it. Cheers. Ready, go. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Cheers are empties. That rock. I'm here in Manhattan's West Village at Sweet Revenge. And as you can see, it's actually happy hour. Happy hour with cupcakes. So forth hour. Marlo Scott is the creator behind the cupcake wine and beer pairings. Is then, this like a chaser or it's, just? It's kind of a chaser, but while the cupcake is actually in your mouth, you're gonna try it because then you're gonna see how the flavors work together. There's wine in the cupcake There too? is, in the frosting. This is like a boy combo. I think dudes would like this a lot. Do you wanna try this dude pairing? You look like you're busy yeah. really hard at work, and I think a beer helps studying so often. That's really good. To cupcakes and alcohol. Cheers. Cupcakes and alcohol. My final sweet stop was Tony's Minis Bakery in Harlem, where cupcakes come in all shapes and sizes. We have the mini, the California size, and then the Hollywood size. Customers custom order their cupcakes, and I was taking requests. I'm going for the loop-de-loo. Okay, do you have a particular color you like? Because I really think the red's gonna look pretty on here. Would you like to quality control to make sure they're good? Yeah, we'll both do that together. <laughs> Those are good, right? You're gonna find some of this later when you shower, because it's gonna go down your shirt, I guarantee it. Go, go, go. All right. <laughs> Was that maybe your best cupcake you've ever had? Justine? Yeah. What did I tell you to say earlier? <laughs> When it comes down to it, I learned the best cupcakes are the ones shared with friends. Whoa, yeah, come on. I feel like we're at our wedding feeding each other. Did that feel awkward for you? I do. And I would never come oh, empty handed, ladies, so I brought some treats. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, what do you want? Seriously, these. These are amazing. They're all amazing. These are but from I think Marlowe's? It, yep. Which we are have. Those, oh, yeah. Those look These good. These are gluten-free. They are? Okay. So I they're the healthy little guy. and fat-free. I like that little guy. coconut one over there, please. Oh, yeah. Thank you, Sarah. Thank you, Sarah. Good Sarah. job. They look delicious. All right, still ahead. What's on your man's mind? Donnie Deutsch, of course, has all the answers. And we're going to make sure your teenage girl...